Hello, Helen Chin Lu here, Certified Reflexologist, Certified Energy Medicine Practitioner, a Reiki Practitioner and Teacher, and I'm also the owner of The Healing Place and The Healing Place Energy School. Today's reflexology tip. I was asked by one of my readers how to go about addressing ear issues. Um, fortunately, her mom has a problem in her ears where it's constantly aching. And this is also good uh, for people who have buzzing or ringing in their ears, uh, vertigo, to help to rebalance the energy in the body. So I'm going to show you three methods of healing. We're going to do some foot reflexology, hand reflexology, and ear reflexology. I may be showing this demonstration on only one foot, one hand, and one ear, but obviously you've got to do it on both, all of those, the other limb. Otherwise, what's going to happen, you'll be balanced on one side and be off balance on the other. Uh, and then do this two, three times a day, 10, 15, 20 seconds, until you start to feel better. Some people will feel better quicker and some a little bit slower. But Everybody's body is different, as we all know. So let's start with the foot. I'm going to show you my trusty reflexology feet. In fact, um, I sell these feet. I'm going to put the information in the box below and you can order a pair if you like. So I'm hoping very much everything is backwards as you can see. But your ear reflexology points are in between, at the bottom of your fifth toe and your fourth. It's on both sides. See here I'm showing it. So to press in this area, you want to take your finger uh, and obviously you're supporting the back and you're going to walk across. Walk across like this. See how my fingers are starting to turn white? You want to do it firmly. And if there's a point where it feels a little tender, um, even though I'm going to pretend it's right here, you're going to press a little longer. Just stay there and just rotate. And you're going to do this for the other foot and you're going to walk back and forth. And if this is bothering you, when you can't press, you can put a little bit of lotion and you could address it this way. So that's the foot. That's how you address the ear reflex points on the feet, on the ears. I'm going to use my big ear demonstration. So your ear uh, reflex point, it's on the earlobe, is primarily where I would say women wear, or me even men, insert the earring in the middle of the lobe, right about there. So imagine if your earring hole is about here, on the right ear, your right, uh, on your right ear, the ear reflex point is to the right of this, so you want to move it over slightly and just rotate. Do the same thing. You could both do this on both your ears at the same time. And if it's on the left ear, it's on the left of the hole. So again, you're just pressing. And that's how you address it in your ear. So you, wherever your earring hole is, usually about here, it's either to the right or to the left. I hope I didn't get it mixed up, because here I am, I'm watching myself. And I'm trying to talk over my ears. In the hands, same thing. Your hands represent the which is exactly the same way as the feet. So the ear reflex point is under the pinky finger and the fourth finger, and you're gonna walk across. Here I am doing the twisting. Again, if you have a tough time doing this, you could put a little lotion and slide, but I prefer the thumb method, where you're inching around very closely like a worm. And again, see how my thumbnail is a little bit white? You wanna apply good pressure and you're going to do the same on the other side, and you're going to walk across. So this is my hand, foot, air reflexology tip for helping to bring uh, less pain, I should say reduce pain in the ears, reduce vertigo, dizziness, ringing, and do it several times a day. You don't have to do it for long. You could do it 10, 15 seconds per spot. So again, if you want to do it in the ears, you can stand there because there's so little spot there. When you press on the earlobe, you're addressing the, everything in the head. 
<laughs> and if people ask you what you're doing, you just say, I'm working on myself. So that's my tip for today. Helen Chin Lu from The Healing Place and The Healing Place Energy School. I'll talk to you really soon. Bye-bye.